Hi everyone. Prisons are a very dangerous place, and since prisoners have a lot of free time, they come up with different ways to hurt their cellmates or parole officers. The weapons we are going to show you in this video were invented in different prisons around the world, and in some cases they were successfully used. Let's get it on. Shank Shanks are handmade prison knives. This is the most popular weapon among prisoners. They're often made out of toothbrushes because they're easy to get. The prisoners usually sharpen the toothbrush or use it as a handle with a razor blade melted in. In 1994, in a city jail in Germany, a shank was found hidden in a crucifix. Turned out prisoners were making shivs while working in wood shops, but security guards caught them and confiscated all the weapons. Whip this unpleasant tool is not very sophisticated, but quite terrifying. It was confiscated in the Hamburg prison of Fußbüttel in 1996. It was found after an imprisoned drug addict went nuts. He wanted more methadone, but didn't get any, so he grabbed a knife and threatened the nurse. After the incident, his cell was searched and this unusual weapon was found. The prisoner was punished and locked up in an isolation cell for a few days. Nunchucks Lorenzo Pollard was serving his sentence for burglary and resisting arrest in the medium security facility of St. Louis, Missouri, US. On the 12th of September 2011, he proved that even the simplest weapon can be pretty efficient. In his cell, Pollard fashioned a set of nunchucks out of bedsheets and chair legs. Then, using his handmade weapon, he managed to fight off seven guards, jumped over the fence, and escaped. For two days, he was able to hide. But then, on the third day, he was arrested anyway. Handmade Prison Guns These are probably the most dangerous prison-made weapons. In penal institutions of Canada, these staff rules even have a special chapter dedicated only to this kind of arms, and every new employee has to read it first. Inmates love prison guns, because they're easy to hide, small and deadly dangerous. When not used, they're kept dismantled. The separate pieces of this weapon look quite harmless, Often, they're not bigger than a pen, but this gun can be easily hidden even when assembled. A tiny gun was found in a jail in Canada, hidden among tools, and could fire 22 caliber bullets. Another gun of the same caliber was found in Folsom Prison, and it was created using a stapler. Long Spear Nowadays, spears are one of the favorite arms among prisoners. This three-foot-long melee weapon is usually made from rolled-up newspapers and magazines, covered with strips of fabric. This way, it turns out light, but solid. To make the tip, a piece of metal bed is cut out and sharpened. Spears have proved to be very dangerous weapons. At least one murder was committed with it. In 1985, four inmates would count the number of steps it took officers to walk down the hallway for several weeks. This way, they would know exactly when anyone would be walking by their cell. They waited until the sergeant, Hall Birchfield, was passing by their cell and thrust their spear through the bars, hitting him right in the heart. Shotgun this incredible masterpiece was created by two prisoners in Celle, Germany. The barrel was made from an iron bedpost. The handle was made of pieces of lead from curtain tape and match heads to be ignited with AA batteries and a broken light bulb. Seems like these guys spent a lot of time on this weapon, and it came in handy. On May 21st, 1984, they took a jailer as a hostage, showed off their firepower by letting go at a pane of bulletproof glass, and escaped by car. Until today, their future remains unclear. Crossbow Stony Mountain is a maximum security facility in Canada. In 1998, the prison staff found an intricately assembled crossbow in the desiccation area. It was made using all kinds of materials, including 10 toothbrushes, a cigarette lighter, a section from a pair of aluminium cafeteria tongs, and a piece of string. The darts were made from tightly rolled paper, Q-tips, aluminium foil found in cigarette packs, pieces of wire, and masking tape. The prison staff confiscated the weapon and decided to test it. Turned out that the crossbow could fire a dart accurately 40 feet. 